got half a cough drop, but I was going to save it for after work. You can have it if you want. But... Oh, right. Sorry, boss. You know, I was thinking, once you start selling ounces, we can move you up from fractions to whole numbers. I don't know. The folks at my mom's church, Our Lady of Episcopal Misery, they get back from Jesus Camp soon, and they're not going to like this very much. Where exactly are they? At an undisclosed location, learning to live life without joy of any kind. Um, two things. First rule, you don't tell them. Second rule, we're doing God's work. We are? Well, it's a leaf, right? Yeah. And all leaves created by God are perfect. Except the Toronto Maple Leafs. <laughs> that is true, the Toronto Maple Leafs. Ah, they're out of the playoffs now, so we don't have to worry about that. Kevin Loring joining us. You saw him there. He plays Buzz Riel Jr. in a great show on APTN called Health Nuts. Hello. How are you, Kevin? Hi. How are good you? Good to see I'm you, really man. Good. Thank Toronto you. Maple Leafs fan in real life? Or? No. no. Canucks, no. <laughs> good time to be a Canucks fan. Good time to be a Canucks fan. Yeah, absolutely. Now, tell us a little bit about the show. Obviously, we saw a clip there, but tell us a little bit more about Health Nuts. Uh, well, Health Nuts is about uh, my character, Buzz Real Jr., whose uh, father is killed uh, by accident. And so I <laughs> by inherit. Boss. By yeah. Yeah, by an SUV. <laughs> and so I inherit uh, his bar. I think it's a bar. So I go there, I realize he's gone s sober, and it's now uh, a health bar, a juice bar. Yeah. And so I have to prove that I am clean and sober in order to inherit it completely so I can liquidate it and get all the money out of it. And you are a, uh, a former <laughs> professional hockey player uh, that has fallen on uh, hard times. Hard times, yeah. Basically, of your own volition. Right? Yeah, I mean, you yeah. caused your own hard times. That's right, yeah. Uh, how, did, uh, how did you approach this? I mean, because this is like joke, 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 joke all the way along. Like, I mean, the rhythm of the show is so quick and so rapid. Yeah, I mean, that that's, has a lot to do with the writing. The, the writing is really wacky, and, yeah. and the, the actors are, are really on the money, right? It, there's a lot of... Uh, there's a lot of give and play between yeah. us all. Like, uh, there's a lot of there's some improv. There's uh, everybody's got really good timing. And how do you enjoy playing your character? Because he's got like, he's got layers. <laughs> yeah, you know, like I actually have a really, I have a lot of fun playing Buzz. Uh, I, in some ways, he's kind of like an alter ego. Now we're getting into it. to say and, and do things, right, that you always kind of just want to do, right? Yeah, like right. He, there's no way he could do, get away with it, He's one of those characters it, right? that, that there's no censor, you yeah. know what I mean? Like yeah. he thinks he something no and he just kind of says it. That's right, yeah. He's no filter. He's just like, he's straight up. And that's kind of what's in, like he, he says some really um, nasty things and does some really nasty well, there things. There are some, some jokes. Uh, oh, listen to you. Yes. This is Fiona's prudish I voice. I was howling. There are some no, jokes. No, we were howling this yeah. morning we were watching it. But I yeah. mean, the jokes in this are hilarious. And it is the yeah. writing. But you guys, as a group, when you have that chemistry to do yeah. that kind of comedy, it must be yeah. really fun for you guys. The script supervisor, she has this story. When she first read the script, she threw it across <laughs> the room. She's like, what? They can't say that. <laughs> they can't, they do, can't that. do that, right? Like, that's horrible. I was surprised that some of the jokes you were allowed to say on TV. I mean, yeah, the kind of things it. that so people was say. I. Yeah. Oh, really? Really? I was like, okay, here we go. How do I, how do I not come off like a jackass on this? <laughs> you have to really commit to that, though, don't you? I mean, yeah. uh, when, you, when you're when you playing a character, especially a guy who doesn't have a filter like that, I mean, you have... You must have to lose some of your inhibitions to yeah. to just kind of go. Okay, well, I'm going to say this, and people are, you know, someone out there yeah. is going to think this is too much yeah. and too far. Yeah, and but uh, you can, I sort of. Oh I, my God! Can wait, we stop can we, for a second? Can you tell us what's happening here? And just here? quickly have a look. Please at this. elaborate on what is going on here, my friend. Uh, uh, this is a sacred uh, native dance passed down generation to generation. Sacred. Um, <laughs> so this is an art student that does. Uh, yeah. Wow. Yeah. Here we go. Okay. Dude, how speaking of shedding your inhibitions. <laughs> How does the crew not lose it when they you're lose doing it all that? the time? Oh yeah, they, 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 they're losing it all the time. Yeah. How much fun is that though? I mean, when you're with a group of people, and and we know uh, you know Ali Liebert's in here, yeah. and uh, you know a whole bunch of people that we're familiar with. But that's got to be really fun when you have that first couple of days. Everybody finds that rhythm, and then there's that comfort level. As yeah, well, right? and uh, we were just talking how like the first episode, we're sort of really we shot it in series. Uh, um, but uh, the first episode, we were really just learning like how these characters fit into each other. Yeah. But by like the second and third, we're, we just started to roll, yeah. and uh, it just the the chemistry just really. And you've done a ton of theater. Yeah. How is it different for you to do uh, something like television compared to what you do on the stage? Well, I mean, in this one, it's it's this, there's a lot of broadness, but also you have this you know the camera bringing you right down like that. So you just sort of you just you play it uh, more finely, you know. Yeah. And uh, but you can but in the show you can be really broad. 
yeah. right? Uh, and also bring it down again. Had you done a lot of comedy before uh, before this as well? Because I was looking at your theater resume, yeah. and, and there's some pretty heavy projects on there as yeah. well. Yeah, there's some. Yeah, but I've done a, I've done a bit of comedy, but. Uh, I, I had really good training. Like yeah. I, I went to Studio 58 at Langara College, and yeah. uh, and they're fantastic. And so there's a huge range that you learn there. And then um, lots of children's theater when I first got yeah. out, right? Well, and, so you <laughs> really have to work the audience yeah, there, really, right? The pleasure of doing episodic stuff too. I, I always thought was. Uh, you know, you get that opportunity to hone it as you go along. Uh, and I guess it's the same with a the theater run, too. But, yeah. I mean, as soon as you get into, you know, a couple of seasons and, yeah. and 13, 14 episodes, you really get a sense and, yeah. and a feel for, for who it is and, yeah. and the guy that you're playing and yeah. stuff as well. Yeah, and the, and the other actors as well. There's, there's a couple guys that really, uh, they're into improv and stuff like that. And, and uh, so it really... We're just jamming. A How lot much of improv is in there? There's one where you're giving a list of websites, and the list I can of tell that is it ad-libbed for sure. Oh, like, really? oh, yeah, I'm just like. How do you know those websites, young man? <laughs> <laughs> they were pretty dirty. He's giving some <laughs> suggestions to a sex addict on well, where some to websites. find different things. That's there. right. Well, it is a great show. Congratulations yeah. to you Thank and you everybody very much. else who's worked on it. You can check out uh, Health Nuts. It airs Tuesday nights on APTN. Yeah, you'll have a good laugh on that one. We're going to take a break.